Hello friends, today we are going to see the Visual Studio Setup and some live server programming which will speed up your programming level. So you can see we have the extension here and you can click, uh, you can write like uh, we have already installed the NetBeans theme. So you can just type with me NetBeans. So you can see we have the list of uh, themes. You can install any of one. I have installed this NetBeans light theme. It looks very cool and you can install the same in your server also and another thing we i have installed like monokai so it will show in a very dark mode uh, we have to material monokai theme and the monokai contrast there are many monokai things you can install anyone if you want and if you want to ch change the setting from here then we have option you can go to setting color theme so right, right now we have the default uh, visual studio stream just i will change the same and the same way we have the another uh, second session where we have amazing extension like plugin that we can uh, install in the visual studio which you can add your visual studio code and it will surely speed up your developing speed so let me just show you the extension just you can type you can go to extension and you can here write live server okay you can see launch the development local server so here you can click and you can just uh, click on install it will automatically install here uh, i have already installed it and so i will show you the demo how it works i have already opened the default.html screen here you can see just i will close this screen and you can see i have already installed this thing so i will run uh, what you can see we have the hello world also okay just I will so, okay. you can see we have the hello world where uh, now you, you can add some things like uh, we want to add something here below the hello world under some break tag like h2 I will write unique learning okay So from we have uh, so that uh, we have to save the file now you can save and then you have to go and again refresh you can see after that is uh, so that is the hustle between the jumping between the two different things you have to go and visual studio editor and then you have to go to browser and then you have to refresh it and this switching irritating once you install the live server you can see below we have the option of the go live server okay so you can click here and you can see there will be another tab will be open where you can see there is an IP address so that is uh, created on the server this is the IP address 127.001.550 and you can check so server is con constantly checking your files for changes so it will just uh, we will copy this same Just I will copy this and I will just paste it again here. Okay, you can see automatically it has been changed. So I have just missed the tax. Okay, you can see uh, it will automatically change once you write whatever you want to write, it will automatically refresh. So it will easy to uh, navigate through the options and then we have another option where you can have uh, just go to your uh, file setting you can go to save and you can have the setting option where you can just search save so here you can see we have the auto save option after delay right now so you can change it to different also if you want to change and then you have the below you can see there is a thousand uh, milliseconds you have the auto save so you can change automatically it will save and it will automatically refresh in the browser also so whatever you will write it will automatically save and i think this is amazing uh, amazing extension for any kind of the web developing software and then after that uh, so we will move ahead in the next video for the programming series and we will look at some other concept to 
other concept this video was to set up the visual studio and the best programming experience so thanks for watching the video and we will see you in the next video please subscribe us